Hello, uh, this is second part for uh, doing frequency analysis in SOLIDWORKS. Okay, we already know how to do frequency analysis, but um, in this video, I'm going to add some math at the end of this the cantilever because, uh, as I mentioned before, we are not allowed to apply any kind of force for doing frequency analysis because the mathematics doesn't uh, take uh, take into account that forces but um we can apply the, the masses instead of that force okay so that's why i'm going to here uh right now uh, let me draw a sketch at the end of this beam so click this uh, rectangular and my surface is this one and then draw exactly the same rectangular on the on the end of this beam okay and then go back to feature tab and then make both all right so this uh the the both should be really really small it can be uh negligible okay so here i specify 0.1 millimeter right and then here this is really really important you have to keep in mind so merge results i uncheck this merge uh, results okay so click this one now you can see you can see different features so when de defaultly merge results is checked that means there's no separation like that but um, i un once i uncheck that it's totally different features okay so let me go to simulations and then go to a uh, new study here is the frequency analysis now once i click it you can see some difference uh, from the previous one so i have two separated body which means i can apply different density mass density for each okay so first one this one extrude one but both extrude one is just uh, same as before like um, the aluminum alloy 6061 let me find out uh, here go down okay so this is details of 6061 aluminum alloy so just apply that and then close and then now I would like to apply one kilogram mass okay but I'm um, this uh, really really small things one uh, one centimeter by one centimeter cross section 0.1 millimeter thickness that's in order to be one kilogram this mass density gonna be 10 to the 8 uh, kilogram per meter cubic okay so let me apply that so right click on apply edits okay just um, go to here the custom material and then right click on that and then uh, click new categories okay so here let me uh, uh, do YouTube okay and then right click on that and then the add new materials here okay and this is my uh, new materials like that and then you can specify uh, specify anything you want okay so what I really want to change is the density here so this is gonna be 10 to the, the 8 the kilogram per meter cubic and then apply it and close it okay now the fixture gonna be same as before like that okay and then mesh it there's no force and then uh, a little bit move uh, sorry move it and then run it so if you have that mess the resonance frequency gonna be changed uh, a little bit lower than before and uh, as you can see this was like 800 but I'm um, now it's 20 five uh, the hertz for the, red, the lowest resonance frequency okay so this is what we want to add some mass at the end of uh, this cantilever okay thank you if you have any